um, Israel. All of Europe has decided that we should probably let humanitarian efforts into Gaza and stop bombarding them for at least a short period of time. You want to be that way? Fine. No problem for me. It is just America and me. Mm. Yeah, see, like, like we're tight, man. But, but even I can't look away from some of the things. Like, we're, we're just better, right? We need to be better than, than all the bad guys. And it sucks because they get to break all the rules and, and we have to follow them, which, which really sucks. Uh, but you, you could have used a scalpel and decided to use a sledgehammer in most places. So, uh, you know, chill out. Um, or the Gerald Ford and the entire strike group is going to leave, which is going to be real good news for that, that real angry feller on the other side of the Strait of Hormuz. Well, that's, that's real unfortunate, because I just told the kid that uh, if he could successfully intercept himself, um, that we'd send him over there and he could handle the Middle East by himself. When I get high, I get hound speed. Mach 2 bumblebee's a drug for me. My heart! My heart! Kickstart my heart! I mean, I'm impressed that he gave himself a theme song, but you really gotta stop messing with that kid, man. If you say... You do this, and we will let you loose to anything. He will do it. America is just running back home. They found out I have started production on my Su-75 checkmate. So like they say, if you're scared, go to church. Oh, you did not just quote the great Ice Cube to me. All right, listen here, chuckle fuck. Congratulations, you're upgrading from a wood mock-up to a drywall screw held together giant pile of shit. Does anyone know what the Su-75 checkmate looks like? It looks like you, but it came off of Wish with a learning disability. Also, hey, congratulations, Ukraine. You guys just broke the Canadian world record for the longest sniper shot. They had 3,540 meters, and yours was 3,800 meters, and a Russian was on the receiving end of it. It's got to be a proud moment. I mean, yeah, it was a, it was a pretty good feeling. Uh, sorry, Canada, I guess you get them next time. We're, uh... We're real proud of you there, bud. What happens next is my favorite part. What happens next? <laughs> when the sorry stops, the war crimes start. If you smell maple syrup and hear O Canada coming over the ridgeline, just run.